The Life of Charles Mortlock, um, also known as Ch Charles Mortlock. Uh, he lives in the, uh, the village of Aberfraw. Currently he's been in the, a house in Aberfraw for seven years, where he's a caretaker of the village shop. It's a big house and it's old. He has five children and he's married. Uh, his, his wife is of Asian descent. Um, Charles is a carite Noahide, like myself. He's been a carite Noahide for a, a, a while now, and um, I know him on Facebook online. And we've had quite a number of discussions over religious issues. Charles works with um, boats and things, doing, doing various things. Um, he's a uh, he, he has connections to a rabbi. And, uh, discusses things with a rabbi and um, posts various messages and videos on various issues on current nihilism in the group. He uh, is a creationist and strong views on that uh, the evolution thing is false. He has views about uh, geology and um, the uh, faults he finds in um, convection zones in the ocean. doesn't think of convection zones where the water meets the land, but there's a rock cycle going on that sort of same way. He doesn't quite think that. Um, has his own teaching on those ideas. He's married to Myra Mortlock. That's the wife of his name. Uh, uh, he's lived in a place called uh, Kobe, K-O-B-E. I'm not sure where that is. But, um, um, he has a daughter called Carmel Mortlock, a son called Ewan Mortlock, a daughter called Haniel Mortlock, a son called Jack Mortlock, and a daughter called Moriel Mortlock. In, uh, he moved to Kobe in uh, 1969, so he's, he's like 50 odd, somewhere around 50 odd years old. So, uh, he's a bit older than me, is Charles. Now Charles is um, a conservative enough sort of fellow, being a current no he's a conservative enough sort of fellow. He maintains a, uh, a kosher food diet conforming to the biblical rules, but he's not interested in really converting to Judaism. It's not really his thing. He doesn't go the whole way and convert to Judaism. He's um, established enough and happy enough to be a Karite Noahide, uh, with inclinations towards keeping clean and kosher on his food intake. Which is a sensible enough decision, I suppose, if that's the way you want to go about those things. I've known Charles for about two or three years now online and um, he's uh, done a number of videos in the current Noahide group on Facebook on some issues. And, uh, his uh, Aberfraw is of course in the United Kingdom and um, he's a likeable enough fellow as Charles and uh, he, he is, uh, oh, that's about it. Uh, I might give more information later but that's the life of Charles Bill Mock. 